Let me see if I can do that one puzzle that we were working on last stream that I was like, oh god, I don't know if I can do this one right now. I'm kind of falling apart. Yeah, you should probably get some rest. We can catch the, the, the VOD of this later on. Have a good night, Acid. Let's see if I can get this puzzle for real. Uh, nine pins inside it. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 17? How do I put 17 in here? Okay. I don't know how to actually do this one. I'm being perfectly clear. I'm not gonna look anything up though. I'm just wondering what I need to do. So, oh right, I'm still exploded. There we go. So let's see. Oh, it's upside down. So I need to do the same kind of area as this, but I'd need, hmm. Oh, 41, so. 16 plus 17 pins. Wait, is it 41? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, 41 minus. No, it's 49. It's 49. Sometimes known as 49. Look, I'm bad at math, like really bad. I'm, I'm surprised I was able to get that so quickly. Oh, uh, let's see here. So, 40, 49, 49 minus, let's see, that's 33. Does it make 33 pins? How do, I, how do I make it right? This is already, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, 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 forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-se
I'm trying to figure out what I need to um how, how I need to make this shape, which side I need to make this shape, what I need to make it look like. Um hmm. I'm probably gonna get this one just off the top of my head. I'm sorry. I, I still don't like get it. Like I get that that part that you've given me, but I don't know what else I need to do. Hi stripes. What's up? I'm trying to figure out this puzzle. Like Bubu already gave me the hint about I need 33. Oh, I need 49. Minus 33. Okay, okay. Let me just write this down. So I need a cross made of 16 pins. This one's made out of how many? This one's made out of three, five, eight, 11, 13, 16, 19, Yeah, I'm still not getting this. I'm sorry. And you're like, Viv, why are you just not getting this? Then, like, I don't know. I don't know how to like actually make it work in my brain. <laughs> I'm cheating. Option one for a reason. Yeah, but I'm 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 I wanna be big gamer. I wanna be big gamer on campus. I wanna be so strong, I don't even believe how strong I can be. You know, I, I just wanna show off that my brain is huge. But I've already come this far, so I might as well just commit to it, you know. Yeah, I, 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 I admit it. You've got me. I admit it. <laughs> Please use the god. I think you need to, like, some C's in there. Yeah, I've, I've died. I won't do it again. I won't cheat anymore. Critical thinking is the key to success. I won't cheat anymore. Thanks, old boy. With this puzzle solved, I feel like I've drawn one step closer to the altar. Uh, I'm, for it now. I'm done with cheating. What do you want? Mr. Layton, you have some skill at solving puzzles, yes? I once cracked a case of having a puzzle left behind on a note I found hidden at the crime scene. See you fair against it. Yeah, I don't know. I'm sorry.
Detective who was mere days from cracking an international smuggling ring has suddenly gone missing. While inspecting his last known location, find a note. The note appears to be nothing more than a series of numbers that Rigette tells you that this note will be the name of a crime, king, crime kingpin. Currently, there are three suspects in the case, Bill, John, and Todd. Can you break down the detective's code and find the criminal's name? Pfft. <laughs> Isn't this one 40 picarets? Really? Really? No, it shows up in my chat, too. I can't believe this one's worth 40 picarets. That one was way harder. Bill is the boss. He sells oil. Oh. Luke, here's my answer. That's 40 picarets? <laughs> Critical thinking is the key to success. That's right. If you look upside down, you notice that the numbers represent real letters and that the letters form legible sentences. The mess recorded there is Bill is boss. He sells oil. Impressive, Mr. Lighton. I've seen the rumors telling old scale one totally unfounded. But don't go getting on ideas. Do the small thing leave the detective work to me. In the meantime, you can occupy yourself by searching for the golden app. I don't know. The emotes are on the on the in the chat. Oh, professor, how fortunate is she at a time like this? I have a favor to ask of you. Please, madam, ask away. I'm gonna come to your aid in any way that I can. Thank you, professor. Could you solve this puzzle for me? Though I'm not feeling up to the challenge, it won't solve itself. I think Sanjay can see the fucking well, fucking Pepe's an emo picker. The father and son are in a conversation. The father turns to the son and says, "You know, son, there was a time when your old man was twice the age of your mother. Of course, next year is only one and a half times her age, but still, it's pretty amazing, eh? If her father's forty-four years old. How old was the mother?" Are you gonna go on a watch list for this one, bud? I don't know. I legit don't know. So let's see. If 22, he's 44. And once, Forty four divided by two is just twenty two. But twenty three isn't one point five times twenty four. Let me see here. So let's see. But 44 isn't 1.5 times, wait, let me just, I actually don't know what you're doing. Uh, 
I'm going to write this on a different sheet of paper. Okay, so... I just got to use a calculator. I can't do math right now. What the fuck am I thinking? Hmm. Okay, so... That's about as clear as mud. An old man is twice the age of your mother, so 22. One and a half times her age the next year. Hmm. she aging backwards yeah that didn't give me a good like answer they give me like 29.3 repeating and it, it, she won't jump from like 22 to 25 29 in a year so I could use some cash and stuff, so please consider donating. I could use some cash and stuff. Oh, I also could use some cash and stuff, so please consider donating. I'm, I'm trying to, like, not over shill, but also I could. I, I, I'm, I'm broke. Please, please, please. This, uh, this living expenses bar is no joke. Could use more money. Also, could buy a com from me. Yeah, I saw. I'm just, I'm, I'm asking the people who are in chat, and also if people want to like boost my content or anything in other places. So consider doing that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna post links to my clips on, on, on fucking Tumblr, I think, when I'm done streaming. Uh... I'm just trying to advertise a bit because money is tight and I need to pay off getting these meds that I had to basically get um this game is fun I'm just having a hard time figuring out this puzzle Please stop dropping frames, please. Thank you. Uh, mom is four. Father is forty-four year old. Is the mother? I'm twice the age of your mother. So, what's it trying to do? You know, that makes sense, that makes sense, that makes sense. Cause if he was... Yeah. Cause... Let's see. Uh, twice the age of your mother, so... If... The mom was... So if the dad was... One... Let's see, twice the age. So, okay, I think I might know. So, I think he's saying that the mom is 42.
that's what I'm thinking. But I'm not sure if that's the actual case. Because... Twice her age... She's one. The next year, 1.5. It's like a like two-year difference, I think? Roughly? <laughs> Excuse me. Because if he's two... Because if I... Uh, he was... Hmm. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a it's a year difference. It's a year difference. So she's forty three. There we go. Critical thinking there we is the go. key to success. That's right. Mother is thirty forty three years old. When the mother, when the boy's father was two years old. His mother was one. Next year, he turned three and she turned two. When you realize this is the only combination of the age that yield more children in the problem, everything starts to make sense. Yeah. There we go. What a relief. I can finally stop thinking about that silly puzzle. You have my thanks. I'm dropping frames like crazy now. Please stop. For real, this is bad. I might end in a little bit, but we'll, we'll play a little bit more of Leighton. We'll see what's going on with the story a bit more. Hi, Ingrid. Oh, look who it is. Professor Ladle, was it? The name's Leighton, ma'am. Oh, that's right, Professor Leighton. I'm not talking about the mansion we did last time, but me reminiscing. So I decided to stop by for a visit. What about me? Well, you know what face? But by the look on your face, it seems you have something you want to ask me. Matter of fact, I do. Do you know? Do you happen to know who Baron Rydal considered his closest friends? Close friends? His friends, you say? Well, it wasn't exactly what you'd call a social butterfly. I'm sorry, that's really all I knew of his friends. Oh, wait a moment. I do believe I saw that Zippo and Philip pay a visit to the mansion a few times. Oh, sir, could you be referring to the man we met? Ah, yes, I remember the friend's little mustache. We should ask if he knows anything. He was just hanging around the Faulkner Ridge, the clock tower. Alright, let's give me this opponent. Hopefully I can get there without my frames, like, dying. I'm at, like, 3,000 dropped frames. I think, it might be, I think it might be the golden hour, where, like, people just decide to stream, and the overbloat is a bit too much for Twitch to handle. Lady Dahlia sure is gorgeous, ain't she? Yep, sure is. What a dish, what a doll, what a honey. Guys like that are pretty rare, though. Yeah, yep, yep. Fucking <laughs> ducky land before time over here. Yep, yep, yep. Get me in there. Is there anything possible with these two? You sure don't seem a lot of animals around town. You're quite the animal, aren't you? Oh, come on, enough time to sit here and play around. No one asked? <laughs> hey, mister, it's good to see you again. Seems totally stuck here. I can't even use your help. I tried to win this puzzle the other day, and I just can't solve the thing. Could you help me? Alright, Lucy. What do you got? 
the chocolate code. On Valentine's Day, your gadget-loving, technophile girlfriend gave you a must, most unusual slab of chocolate. If you jump the levels, and while well, the jump the levels look like nonsense, manage to code the letters written on the chocolate. A message from your sweetheart will appear. What's she trying to tell you? So, hmm, decode the letters. So, let's see here. Okay, that's not it. Oh, hey, what's up? I won. Barfk, barfk. <laughs> trying to figure out this puzzle with chocolate. <laughs> I guess so. When, and you're just gonna sit out there sitting on your gilded throne acting like you're also not like tangential just 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 have just just join us coward join us join us well yeah Jonesy's always had a cat sona Jonesy is the cat sona <sighs> anyway um guess he are cringe though yeah jonesy definitely feels like that kind of like black cat that's like a vague shape g e c y n w hmm okay question are the uh are the are the bites important like little 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 chomp marks Gwen's doing a uh, a TFS bit I think I'm not sure check all his bite marks oh you're not okay never mind them I stand corrected I think Jonesy's very shy, I ask, personally. Um, hmm. <laughs> there could be two shy guys in my, in my Twitch chat. There can be doubles. You don't have to worry about, like, one person taking your- biting your style. It's fine. I played Yoshi and Mario Kart with the GBA and I learned very recently that it fucked me over because you get bonus points because of how much traction the character has and Yoshi that literally gave you the least amount. Damn. Um. What's this mean?
I'll use a hint. It's rather surprising that your girlfriend would leave you a message via chocolate. It's usually your style to connect, contact you via digital means. Hmm. Is this RAM? Mush the chocolate in your disk drive? I will not. Nah, I think you're good. Live with your typo. Live with your typo. It's time for you to type. Uh... No Ned? Uh, where? Ah, I see. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> I see what she means. That's what she means. <laughs> wait, wait, type, wait, slur with the. Sure can, sure can. Oh, you can. Hmm. Kind of via digital means. This is not a typo. As a self-proclaimed gadget fiend, I'm more than one occasion suffer from the modern, uniquely modern condition of texting phone. I think I'm understanding it, but I also probably am not. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I probably need to... Hmm. Let's see. Four. Three. I don't think there's anything. I'm just looking at stuff real quick. Wait, no, it's three nines here. UTF six. Oh, I'm looking. 
looking at a flip phone. Looking at a flip phone. And I'm just looking at like how many times you'd press like the phone to uh, press the the key number to get it to work. But I know it's not anything. I should have figured it's not anything. But I'm just looking at this. I want a flip smartphone. I don't know. I like the ability to just go clat. And not having that with like regular smartphones is kind of whack, if I'm being honest. Um. I wouldn't mind doing an escape room with people. That'd be fun. I don't have really anyone to do stuff with. Everybody else is like on different parts of the country. I should probably like try and get friends closer to closer nearby, but I am afraid of trying to do stuff because, well, as you might expect, being being trans and 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 is is difficult to make friends with. Not impossible, just difficult. Uh, let's see here. Also, I can't drive. That's another wrinkle. Let me look at the phone again. Um, oh, also I got it wrong. So let's see here. It's four, I I wouldn't mind learning how to learn how to drive, especially because I would like to just move around a bit more freely, but your closest keyboard for a hint. I'm just afraid of driving because I'm not gonna have like my meds after a certain point because they're expensive as fuck. Bobu, I legit can't get down there without having to drive, alright? Buddy. So I don't. I don't. I'm afraid of being behind the wheel. Also, my bitch, I'm afraid of being perceived in public. Fuck you. <laughs> Also, yeah, sure, Gwen, you need to throw a hint my way. And ultimately, you need to get over my, like, fear of being perceived, but, like, it sucks still.
A little bit, yeah. A little bit. Hey, can I get some... I, I still need to figure out what the hell I'm doing here. Can you, can you give me a hand here? I am not sure what I'm doing. Bites are important. <laughs> you can share! You can share! Get your keyboard. I don't know a whole lot about bites. Wait, hold on. Like... I think I understand now. I think I understand now. It's the bytes are aiming at another like key on the keyboard. I see. I see. I see. I see. I see. I think I get it now. Oh wait, no. I, I do like I think she's all right. She's probably the only good character in the show. Luke, <coughs> here's my answer. But you know, you think she's gonna get anything? Every puzzle. My hero is bad, but yeah. The girlfriend must just text me. The bites take on the chocolate show you relate to. How each letter written on the chocolate relates to letters on the keyboard. Yeah. Was that all you had to do to figure it out? Why didn't I think of Why didn't I think of that? Can you keep a secret? Can tell Andrea to me. I'm told Adria told me the answer, okay? Thanks, mister. <laughs> so that is a poem. Close friends of the Baron. It's true. I had the pleasure of meeting Baron Reinhold a few times. Mrs. So, poem, you don't happen to be good friends with the Baron, did you? Me? <laughs> oh no, it was, it was nothing of the sort. You think of anyone all who was close to the Baron Reinhold? No, we didn't really know him. Well, there was that one possibility. No, wait, never mind. I'm not sure. I guess the can really tell us much of anything. Because I'm afraid he was no help at all. I suppose that means we're back to where we started. At least now we can make sure that the close friend of Arthur is a measured him sent Miss Dare. Let's give up with him. Let's continue to ask around. Gwen, Gwen loves Leighton. What's this? It's a trash! What is this thing on the ground there? Around here. You're right, it needs to be a scrap of paper. Let me check if everything's written on it. Sure thing! Let's see here. 
the boss complimenting my latest model today. He's a good guy and give me a new sense of purpose. I'm sure this is my true calling. I want to perfect my skills so I can pay the man for his generosity. It's like a great deal, like a journal entry, doesn't it? You know how the writer uses the term the boss. I imagine he was under the employee of the bank. I can use models for every situation that the boss asked me to do. I gotta smile when I see how, I, I gotta smile when I see how interested he is in them. Yeah, I know about Chekhov's gun. That's the end of the entry. Do you suppose this person made us one of models for a living? Hmm. Not being a member of high society myself, I've never so much as had a conversation with Baron Reinhold. Now, son, if I don't need to keep chatting, I'm awfully tired. I think I should need to go lay down. Feeling unwell, sir. I'm just plumb exhausted lately. It's awful noise coming to the tower, you see. That's a lot. I can't sleep a wink at night. Do you know what's causing the noise? It's just a rumor, but I heard that every time the sound is the same as stairs, someone disappears. The ones who go missing people have been talking about feeling tired. Those who disappear back before you know it, it's probably just a lot of puppy cock. Where the noise sounds, someone disappears. Interesting. I think we carry that sound, I think you give it a. That strange old man, was that Ramon? Can we not have a, an argument in chat, please? Let's chill. <laughs> if we're having an argument, that is. I'm not sure if it is one, but it, I, I feel like we might be having one. It's an impossibility, isn't it? How would he release his victims without going through the trouble of kidnapping them? He's winding them up. And he is the pitch. <clears throat> you there. Yes, you. Do you mean me, good sir? Yep, you. This far away is yours, right? Let me keep you nice and safe for you. I've never seen anyone just forget something like this while shopping. You're a, you're a vase space case, har har. Good luck. Good luck on uh good luck being a squiddo and a kiddo. I'm sorry, but I must be mistaken. I've never met that I've never seen that voice. I've never seen that face before in my life. What? This friend's face doesn't belong to you? So that guy told me to give this to you. Hmm? What this man look like? Well Matt has a way of screwing certain details for me. It's the worst, I tell ya. Ha <laughs> ha. Back to the issue at hand. Mystery man wasn't regular around here, that's for sure. But don't sweat it though. I'll just give it back to the guy the next time I see him. Speaking of flower vases, it's not a puzzle you'd like. I bet you'd like. It's not a hot one or anything. But this could do about bothering you for the vase. For the vase. This one should be not that hard. Shattered vase. Okay. Solved. Make out post stream. I might go make some chicken. I'm only repairing things in real life is this simple. Tell me about it. You got a good head on your shoulders. I'm impressed. By the way, you shouldn't sure want to take some fresh sausage home with you. Believe me, these are some links you don't want to be missing. Or her. No, thank you. I'm just fine. Too bad. Not to bust your chops or anything, but that deal was a one time offer. Maybe I'd have said yes if I knew it was at stake. Or her. I think we're done. I'm gonna agree more, Professor. Man, these guys don't know what appreciate a good joke. Ooh, scrap of paper. What kind of lout just throws trash on the ground? I'm going to pick it up. It's an old newspaper. Honestly, you think that everyone would know that trash goes in? Everyone would know that trash goes in the trash. Wait a second. Let's come look at this article. Well, would you look at that? It seems you're Inspector Chelmy. <laughs> look at that. Chelmy held his plain detective and devoted husband. Chelmy celebrates each successful, each successful case with his favorite treat, his wife's sweet potato fritters. Oh, who saw that coming? Who's that one coming? He saw Craft, I never imagined he had a soft side like that. 
<laughs> so the little grump came in on his plate of sweet potato fritters. We were supposed to come in nothing when he said he hated sweets back at Reinhold Manor. Hmm. That's right, Luke. He did say that. How very curious. Fridged wife. Fridged wife. Fridged wife. So is it true I'm hearing about the two of you? Are you really running about telling us the Reinhold fortune? That's correct, sir. Coming in search of a close friend of Baron Reinhold's. I believe he's interested in this friend with an important note. Gracious, it's quite a search you have on your hands. Oh, excuse me, my name is Archibald. Gus, I mean, the Baron and I were thick, great friends, thick as thieves. These are the most amazing conversations in late into the night. Can you perhaps I am the one you're searching for? Yes, I think so. What luck after all this searching would you to bump into you in a place like this? I have one question. Do you recall ever seeing a small little written message from the Baron? Hmm, I don't remember we receiving anything of the sort from Gus. You did give me a fine desk that once belonged to him. It's at home. Maybe it holds some sort of clue? Baron's desk, you say. Excellent! I wonder how to take a look at it. You're most gracious. It would be kind of to last look at it. We'd be very grateful. I'm sure Gus wouldn't mind two puzzle levels such as yourselves looking over his desk. Hmm. Actually, let me impart a few pearls of wisdom on you will have had got your attention. Because you know, case is all well and good. We don't solve some puzzles, we solve it later. Make an effort to find puzzles around town. Just solve as ones you can. Even from this all the time. Just stop and spell the puzzles sometimes. Alright. Go to my house now. Let's go to my house. Follow me. Stretch. This is Gus's old desk. Still the time you need to examine it. Splendid. Let's get right to it. Nice. <gasps> Need to be a note. That person in direction of the golden apple. What do you make of this X? Hmm. I'm afraid I just don't know at the moment. Okay, I finished the chapter finally. It's only taken me 80 years. I don't interrupt you, but I just received a call from the innkeeper, Be Beatrice. Seems she's concerned about one of her lodges and liked her thoughts on the problem. Well, the best will help her. Thank you, Archibald. After the end, we get back. Alright, we'll, we'll call it here before my ISP decides to kill me. I've been playing a randomizer Paper Mario recently. That one, I've been having a lot of fun with it. Let me see real quick if anybody's live. Oh yeah, Deck is still alive. What's going on with Deck? Uh, consider donating to the stream and subbing and following if you haven't already. Um, I'll be, I stream every day. Buy something from me if you want to. Uh, help me out on my own throne if I can afford a new mattress. And, uh, you know, buy something from me. I have a store. Anyway. Thank you. I'll hang out with y'all later. Have a good night, everybody. Later days.